everyone welcome back to lioness sim sim kitchen here in the kitchen today we're gonna be making some soya milk smoothie festivals and fry fish don't go nowhere i will be right back here i have all the ingredients for the soya milk smoothie here i have soya beans soaked this is six cup of soya bean soap for six hours. One cup roast peanuts. One cup oatmeal, regular oatmeal. Two ripe bananas. One cup brown sugar. One tablespoon vanilla. One teaspoon cinnamon one teaspoon nutmeg. egg here i'm gonna go ahead and blend the soya bean to make the soya milk here you have the soya bean in the blender i'm gonna go ahead and blend the soya beans and then i'm gonna go ahead and add the soya bean to a pot for it to cook for at least 15 to 20 minutes to get the soya milk. So I'm gonna go ahead and blend the beans. Here I blend the soya bean. I'm gonna go ahead and cook it for at least 15 minutes. Here's what it looks like. I'm gonna go ahead and make some soya milk. Here you have the soya milk it has been cooking for quite a while guys i'm gonna go ahead and remove it from the stove and strain it so here i have the cooked soybean milk and i'm gonna go ahead and strain So guys, I have two and a half cups of soya bean milk strain, and this is the cup that I'm using. You just gotta remove all this from the soya bean milk. So mushy right here, guys. You do not need this in your soya milk. You gotta take it out after you blend it and boiled it. So here I have the strain soya milk and I'm going to go ahead and pour it in the blender. It's very rich guy. So here in the blender we have the soya milk and it's seven cups. So here I have the ripe bananas. I'm going to go ahead and pour it in. One cup brown sugar, peanuts, roasted peanuts, oatmeal, I'm going to go ahead and blend. Here I have the vanilla. And pour it in. Nut and egg. Cinnamon. Just gonna go ahead and blend it. Look at the richness. There you have it. Soya milk smoothie. 
I'm gonna go ahead and place in the freezer for it to be a bit chill here I have the fish multiple different types of fish that I will be using in the menu today I'm gonna go ahead and add some seasonings to the fish and then I'm gonna go ahead and fry them so here I have homemade peppers I had vinegar carrots scotch bunny peppers and onions that I will be using in the menu today guys here I have a blend of seasonings seasoned salt maggie fish season garlic powder paprika black pepper I'm just combining all these seasonings together guys the blend of seasonings I'm gonna go ahead and grab one of the fish and put some seasoning on the fish here I have some garlic and scotch bunny pepper I'm just gonna add it to the oil just to season the oil I'm gonna go ahead and add the fish to the oil Here you have the fish frying it's been frying for quite a while now guys I'm getting ready to remove them from the pot take a good look at them so here I have the fish well fried and I'm gonna go ahead and add my marinade onions scotch bunny peppers and carrots and I marinated in vinegar I'm just gonna go ahead and spread them all over the fish just to give it an amazing flavor guys it has amazing flavors here you have the marinade fish take a good look at it the smell is amazing guys so today I will be making festival look at it it's Jamaican dough festival here so here I pour one pack of the festival dough half cup of sugar half cup of rice and flour one third cornmeal I will be adding water to make a dough
Just combine all the ingredients together. Here you have the festival dough. It's been sitting for at least five minutes. You can see it rise. So I'm gonna go ahead and start making the festivals. I'm gonna go ahead and show you how I do the first one. Here you have the festival. Here is the festival. They've been frying for quite a while now, guys. The color is amazing. Just gonna let the festival stay and fry for a little bit longer, guys. Just to let you guys know, you have to keep the flame on low because I add sugar to my festival and sugar burn easily so you have to keep the flame on low guys we have the marinade fish going on here and then we have festival can't wait to take a bite i love me some festival guys fry fish wow here you have the finished touch amazing color guys everything looks so delicious i can't wait to have a bite a big bite a huge bite this is one of my favorite here is a finished touch jamaican festival fried fish soya milk smoothie Let's taste. Don't have a fork. Don't use my hand. It's really, really good. It's the best I ever had. Let's try the fish. Don't need a fork. It's just fried fish. It's a bit spicy. It's good. It's delicious. Crunchy and good. I can't stop eating it. It's really, really good. You should try it. Let's try soya milk smoothie. Take a look at it. It's very rich, smooth. Let's have another taste. You should try it. I love this one. Thank you for watching my channel. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for commenting. Thank you for sharing. Please stay tuned for more videos from the Lioness in Simmer Kitchen. Thank you so much.